you in a stealth game? Surprisingly, like, I'm good in that game. <laughs> but the thing is, like, I would want to play, like, the original, not, like, the new one. But I don't know how to do that. I don't know. Thief sounds so random. We brought it up because... Uh... We brought it up. We brought it... Dear brought Ned, it here I am on a fairy bound for Deception Island. Dear Ned, here I am on a fairy bound for Deception Island. Dear Ned. Dear Ned. Dear Ned. Dear Ned. It was because of Summer Game Fest. You were trying to reminisce about a game. Yeah! And it was Thief. Maybe next time. That's fine. Okay. All right. Let's start. Welcome to my latest case, Danger on Deception Island. To learn how to play, choose Gameplay Overview. When you're ready to start the game, choose either Junior or Senior Detective. You are so peppy, Nancy. You need to take a chill pill. That's my job, ma'am. <laughs> Compared to what you usually play? Oh, it's 100% totally random. But it was because... I just wanted to throw other options out there because I don't, I don't know. I don't know what you guys want from me. I'm trying to give you other options. Nancy just sounds like a peppy seven-year-old woman. She does sound really old. I mean, she is older. She's supposed to pretend. I don't know why they did that. They made her voice so old. But she legit is like a 16 to 18 year old girl. <laughs> Anyways, senior Dear Ned, here I am on a ferry bound for Deception Island, one of the San Juan Islands off the coast of Washington State. George's Washington! friend Katie Firestone is expecting Woo! me. Katie's a marine biologist who's doing Katie! research into deep water parasitic growth. She also owns a whale watching boat and takes whale! tours out practically every day. I should be excited. But for some reason, I feel on edge, like something's out of whack. Oh. Maybe it's because George and Beth arranged this little vacation for me, and sometimes their plans don't work out so well. Or maybe it's because we're about to dock at a place called Snake Horse Harbor. Kind of a creepy name for a town, don't you think? Snake or maybe Horse. it's because I haven't been on vacation for so long that I've forgotten how to relax. Anyway, we're here. It's not raining, but it's not sunny either. It's just kind of gray. Maybe that's why I feel so strange. Every year's Nancy. I think it's the music that I really liked in this one. I don't know why. Katie? Or somebody Hi, ping you Orca. must be Nancy. I'm Katie Firestone. Come on, I'll take you down to the boat. Great timing, huh? I just got back from getting some groceries. George could not have picked a better time to arrange for you to come out here. Just last week, this orca showed up in the channel, and now it... Oh my gosh, what happened? Someone tore the place apart. The engine's a mess, parts are missing, others are damaged. Why Guess would we can't go on that this? whale tour. No, ping orca, tell him we're playing his game. Hi, Rock! Thank you for the bits and hanging out! Thank you. It's very foggy. Are you gonna be able to fix it? I better be able to. I can't afford to pay someone else to do it. And if I end up having to replace a lot of parts, I don't know what I'm gonna do. We better call the sheriff. Actually, I'd rather not get the sheriff involved. The insurance company would raise my rates, and I just can't afford that. Oh, I Besides, feel that. <laughs> I've got my very own private detective now. You. What? Me? Okay. Are you sure you don't want to call somebody? Look, you're on vacation. Hang him on Discord. Just go relax. Or doing? bike into town, or, or take my kayak <laughs> out. It's at the end of the dock. Kayaking. Just always wear your life jacket. And don't go past Ooh. the channel markers. Ooh. And if the fog starts coming in, head to shore fast. So the fog rules. we get around here is as thick as cotton. So and never go out without a die. GPS. That's a global positioning system. Really? Run somewhere around here. Anyway, your bunk's the empty one below. Why don't you go unpack? Lady, it just need any help? Nope, I'm all unpacked. The lady literally just spilled her guts to me and said, "Good luck." <laughs> Gosh dang! Chalk 
Rocco Pottery Reconstruction Beach Hill Museum. <gasps> we played this game! Tattler. Mayan temples used as alien landing pads. Okay. Hey, look. These look familiar, too. This is literally from the game we played in the, the haunted carousel. I love when they do little things like that. Like we could recognize where they're from. What is this? Mini freeze? Wonder what's in here. Ice. We're on a boat, chat. Easter eggs, yes, Easter eggs. Deception. There's Orca. I found Orca, guys. I found Orca. He may not be here in chat, but he's over here. Found him. <laughs> What is this? It looks like whoever damaged your engine did something to your faucet, too. It'd be great if you could fix it. The pipes are in the cabinet under the sink. Lady, do you think I'm a plumber? At least the person who messed up the faucet left all the pipes here. I hope. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's inside the cave. She didn't want the police involved. She did it, calling it now. Oh, you think so? I mean, that it is suspicious that she didn't want to get the cops involved. That is suspicious. But I also kind of agree about the insurance. But that doesn't don't do go that. there. That doesn't go there. Oh. That doesn't oh my go God. there. How do pipes work? That doesn't go there. What? Ah! What do I do? That doesn't go there. Shut up, Nancy. Oh. Ooh. Do I have to use all of them? This goes here. Oh. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Whitney! Thank you for the reason! Hello! How are you this Sunday? These kind of mini games suck. These are the mini games that you guys can't help me with. Like, I'm literally. This is just gonna be me, like, struggling. That doesn't go there. Shut up. That totally that fits. There. That doesn't go there. Do they have to be like matching color? That doesn't go there. Is there a schematic? I'm too afraid to back out now. Doesn't go I feel there. like there's a wall here, so I feel like we have to avoid this and like go around it and then like around it. Like that's what I'm thinking. But these are a hundred percent correct because I can't even touch them anymore. Hi PJ. I guess the easiest solution is to literally go in order. That doesn't go there. doesn't go there. This goes here. Yeah, we're doing it. Oh, the colors. The colors. Hi, Sarah Nico. Got off work a while ago. Now I'm hungry. I can't decide what to eat. What are your options? That doesn't go there. What 
That doesn't work. That doesn't go there. It doesn't go there. It doesn't go there. We're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. Yeah. That doesn't go there. Chicken and rice. Spaghetti. Oh, sushi. Sushi! Sushi! Lots of rice. Sushi. Nah, you have to make it. But it needs some meat. Mmm... Turkey? Chicken? Chicken and rice is good. Okay, well that was amazing. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm on a roll! I'm on a roll. It's all fixed. I'll turn the water back on. Hmm, there was something under the pipes. Yeah, God Gamer! Speedrunner! Whale World, Andy Jason. Oh, Andy did it. Andy did it. Whale World? Don't just watch a whale experience it. No, thank you. Andy? Wait. Whale World? Is that her competitor? Oh my god, he did it! I'm assuming that her place is it. <gasps> what is this? Oh. Oh, chat! Would you like me to make you a sandwich? <laughs> With... Got some ham. And some tomato and some lettuce. Would you like some... Ham? Wait, no. No! Oh crap, what do I do with this? <laughs> Go away. Okay. Um, we got some... No. It won't be much of a sandwich if I don't put something in it. Habanero it sauce. It won't be much of a sandwich if I don't put something in it. <laughs> There's mayo. It mustard. It won't be much of a sandwich if I don't put something in cheese, it. Cheese. Jellyfish? It won't be much of a sandwich Wait. if I don't put something in it. Jellyfish! Gross. What happens if she eats it? Ew. Ooh, suddenly I don't feel so good! You gave yourself food poisoning? All I know is I made myself a sandwich and ugh, it didn't agree with me. The ideal sandwich is a visually pleasing combination of high quality carbohydrates and protein. Just keep it simple and you can't go wrong. Jeff Sherwood says, Sorry guys, gotta go. <laughs> Oops. Okay. No oh, wait. Um. <laughs> what is this? Ice cream sandwich. It won't be much of a sandwich if I don't put something in it. Jam. It won't be much of a sandwich if I don't put something in it. Some sauce. It won't be much of a sandwich if I don't put something in it. Some baking it soda. Some is this peanut butter? It. Peanut butter and jelly it won't be sandwich. Much of a sandwich if I don't put something in it. And then. It won't be much uh, of a sandwich ketchup if I don't put something and moldy it cheese. It won't be much of a sandwich if I don't put something in it. Okay, what sandwich would you guys like for me to make you today? Chef Kylie is is uh, in the kitchen putting on my apron. What would y'all like? What do I hear? Mayo only. Um, a ninja. Don't burn down the kitchen. I don't think I'll do that. It won't be much of a sandwich. You don't put something on it. <laughs> on it, Epic! Or is it in it? Jelly and cheese. Okay, sir, you would like a jelly and cheese sandwich? Jelly and cheese. Okay, keeping it. All right, next. Peanut butter. Oh darn it! I have to. It oh, I can only be make much one. Of a sandwich if you don't put something. Oh my in god. It. Um, <laughs> ketchup. Mm. 
ketchup. And what else? And, and peanut butter. Okay. Alright. Um, ham. Okay. Ham. Lettuce and tomato. Okay, got the classics. What else? What else? Ninja, um, not Ninja. Lemon, you're gonna have to watch out. Kylie cooking stream coming through, okay? <laughs> ice cream? Always got I get the ice cream sandwich. Eat it. Mm. Ew! She ate it! She ate it! Wait, is there a missing cat? Don't put something in it. What? I'm gonna do classic peanut butter sandwich. Eat it. Mm. There's a missing cat on the refrigerator. Ew! Mayo peanut butter? Will she eat that? Oops, wait, I meant to eat it. Eat it. Ooh, suddenly I don't feel so good! You gave yourself food poisoning? Mayonnaise oh, I know. I made myself killed her. Didn't agree with me. The ideal mayonnaise is a combination of gave her food poisoning. Just and you know what? I'm gonna can't go wrong. Chef Sherwood says. I'm gonna Sorry, double guys. check. Gotta go. There's no way. There's no. Yes. Throw away. Oh my god! If you just eat a mayonnaise sandwich, eat. No. I told you mayonnaise oh, is disgusting I and Nancy is on my side. Nancy Drew is a mayonnaise poison? hater oh, I know. like I me. I made myself a sandwich and ugh, it didn't agree with me. The ideal sandwich is May a mayonnaise, mayonnaise is not a condiment you should ever ingest. Whatever, you sure never digest it. Sorry guys, we Look gotta this. go. This is amazing. Validation. That's validation. Does it expired or it something? Won't be much of a sandwich if I don't put something in it. 1994. Maybe that's like the trick. What day is it? It won't be much of a sandwich if I don't put something in it. Oh my god. Here. There. Keep this for later. <laughs> okay, what else do we have? Oh my god, I love that. I <gasps> this it was yeah, Firestone whale watching tours. Andy is her competitor. Watch, he did this. Town meeting to discuss Orca. Thursday the 16th. Okay, be there. Be heard. Be there. Zang! You saw it. Mayo kills. <laughs> it reminds me of something I saw. Unfollow and leave. Sir, you do not understand. Death by Mayo is a real, yes. Death by Mayo is a real issue here in this world. It doesn't kill, it makes you sick. Well, you know what? Food poisoning can kill you. Hey, look it! It's Ghost Dogs Moon Lake! Ah, Benjamin Hawkins, cleaning supplies. Nancy Drew arriving at 9 a.m. Town meeting to discuss Orca. Oh, I guess it was the day before. Uncle Bob's birthday. Ah, my trusty laptop. Okay, so Good we got a laptop, an anagram uh, buster. Anagram buster. If I come across letters that need unscrambling, I'll be all set. We got the journal. We got some mail. Daddy Drew's day off. Okay. DI portal. Deception Island portal. Ah. Burglaries, plague, snake, ha horse, harbor. <gasps> Where did it occur? <gasps> there was another burglary. Hmm. Oh my god, Zang. Zang's trying to get me fat. Oh, thank you, Lee, for that. Uh, look at Discord if you can. I can look it up on my on my phone. Our fears are valid. What is this? Oh my god. No, I can't watch that. Is it what I'm thinking of? I can't watch that. That's scary. <laughs> I, can't, I can't watch that. That's scary. I thought it was gonna be something about mayo. 
No. It's about whales. I can't watch that, Effin. I can't. You can give it to other people, but I can't watch that. A burglary occurred at the Blue Dew Outfitters shop sometime yesterday. The second burglary to be reported in Snake Horse Harbor in the past week. The Sheriff's Department is unable to say exactly when the burglary occurred. The only reason they called us was because one of their employees noticed a lot of stuff that was in the storage room in the morning was gone when they were getting ready to close, said the Sheriff Guy Dysart. There were no broken windows, no jimmied locks, no splintered doors, nothing to indicate a place had been broken into. A similar burglary occurred earlier this week at Harbor Hardware. Hmm. Interesting. The validation, it reminded me. Well, wait, is that... Here's the gift for the alert. Wait, what? No! Did, is this the person that almost got, or got eaten by a whale in a kayak? Is that it? No, this is what freaked me out. Is this new? Is this another one? Or is it the one that I saw? Oh my god, it was 12 days ago. She lived? Oh my god, I cannot watch that. This is a new one? So this is why you don't mess with whales! People ask me all the time why I'm scared of whales. That's a great example of why you should be scared of whales. I didn't even see it, but I can I can only imagine. Whitney, thank you for the 666. You're so sweet. Thank you so much, Whitney. It was because there was prey around. Yeah! I'm telling you! Even though whales are supposed to be nice, gentle creatures, they will literally gobble the crap out of you. We're no Caleb. There, no, there's no whales in the Gulf. The National Marine Fishery Service ruled last night that an unauthorized boat that comes within 300 feet of the lone orca that has taken up residence in Snake Horse Harbor will be fined one thousand dollars. People in the fishing industry who were at the town meeting when the announcement was made were outraged. They claimed that the orca often approaches boats on its own and that the only way to avoid accidental encounters is to, co is to make a costly detour around the island. The fishery service said their ruling will remain in effect until the orca's physical condition has been thoroughly assessed. If the whale is healthy and if the pod to which it belongs can be identified, the service will attempt to rejoin it with its pod. If the whale is not healthy, it will be transported to a research facility. There are no easy solutions in cases like this, and a fisheries service spokesman said a fisheries service spokesman, no matter what we do, no one is ever happy. So far, efforts to identify the orca and its pot have failed. Holt Scotto runs for Harbor Master. Holt Scotto has formally announced his candidacy for office of Harbor Master. He will oppose incumbent Nelson. Okay, I don't know if I care. Um, we looked it up. Whatever. No, we're not gonna do that. It's a great video, Kylie. You shouldn't watch it. Why do you call it great then, DSS? <laughs> They're not cute. P people don't think whales are cute. There is like one whale or two. Okay, anyways, uh, all right, uh, back to the game. <laughs> all right, I'm already a plumber. You know, Nancy, for what it's worth, I shot my mouth off pretty good at the town meeting last night. Oh, you think that could be why somebody did this to your boat? I did get pretty obnoxious. See, the thing is, this orca, this killer whale showed up in the channel about a week ago and has been hanging around here ever since all by itself. She was getting way too close to boats, so I called the National Marines Fisheries Service. They made some recordings and did some tests and are analyzing them. In the meantime, they ordered all boats to stay at least 300 feet away from her or risk paying a thousand dollar fine. That's what the meeting last night was about. Some people don't like that idea? The people that fish for a living sure don't. They're steering clear of the whale by taking the long way around the island to get out to sea. We just read this. Which costs them so. time and fuel. Some people say she should be captured and towed out to sea. 
And what do you say? I agree with the no-boat zone. I also think that if she's found to be sick, she should be shipped to a research facility for treatment, not returned to her pod. I said as much last night, only much more strongly. Hmm. Hi, Tilly. Um, I was until Evan gave me a link that's gonna freaking scare me if I click it. Don't worry, isn't there like a whale tracker? Well, I ain't gonna find out. I know there's like a shark tracker. Don't click it then. I won't. Geese, for example, look cute and cuddly. Ooh, yeah, that's right. Geese are very... <laughs> Geese are evil. <laughs> there's a whale tracker! I don't know if I want to know where whales are. Is it like... Here, I'll pull it up. But let me say, hold on, let me finish Who's this. Andy Jason? And I'll save. Andy does whale watching tours too. If I had a dollar for every time he's come here trying to talk me into selling out to him, I wouldn't be fixing this engine. I'd be buying a new one. Ah. Uh, See you in a bit. Have fun. It is her competitor. I was right. I was right, chat. I was right. All right. Danger. <laughs> um. I wanted you to know that our fears are valid. Wait! So wait, you're scared of whales now too? Hot single whales in your area. <laughs> Let me... Uh... Oh, look, there's no whales. There's no whales. Where? Where? There's no whales. We don't have anything to worry about. Um, you always have been? Oh, no marked whales. They're all marked. They are protected by the queen, so I can't exactly scold the swan. But it was painful. Oh my god. You got bit by a swan? We're gonna slap that swan. Be like, get, get out of here. No, <laughs> they're off the grid. Whoa, are these whales? I don't know how to read this. Days detected. Are these the only whales? They're like so they're like so far away from me. Maybe use a key on the right. But I thought it was gonna be like an actual whale. Like you know there's a shark finder and they have like names and everything. And that's what I was expecting. Um Yeah, I bet it was thought thinking and terrifying. It's a North American tracker. Oh. Oh oh, Oh my god, you can search for where blue whales are. Oh! <sighs> I'm never gonna go over here. Where is this area? I'm never gonna go to Greenland. Or Iceland. <laughs> Ever. I'm gonna stay away from this area. Gray, thank you so much for the 56 mine! This is all the places I can't ever visit. All of this. They're too close to Ireland, too. I won't go to Ireland. <laughs> Just kidding. Um. Ugh. Yeah, you can, like, search the humpback whale. Why are they all over here? Why are they here? Why do you like that place? Nama, stay away. <laughs> Women. Yes, that's perfect. All right, let's keep playing. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> I made her get up. What do you guys made me do? Do it again. Get up. Oh, just kidding. <laughs> um, what's in here? This note wasn't here before, was it? <gasps> no, whoever Stop. messed up my boat must have written it. Else. <gasps> Stop meddling or else! Whoa! Uh oh, PDGPS doesn't look so hot. 
Uh oh. I better tell Katie her GPS is broken. Toot toot. Toot toot. What's up? I'm afraid whoever tore up your boat also wrecked your GPS device. I wrote it device. to myself as oh, a reminder. No. <laughs> It'd be a shame for you not to go kayaking. I know. What Bite a shame! Go to the Hot Kettle Cafe and see if Holt Scotto will let you borrow a GPS from him. Oh my god. Am I gonna have to kayak by a whale in this game? I can't remember. <laughs> Please tell me. Please tell me that's a no. <sighs> Want a sandwich? See you in a bit. <laughs> Have fun. Uh, can't go kayaking in the ocean where the orca is. <laughs> what? I'm just kidding. When I said this game was calm, <laughs> what was I thinking? <laughs> I'm gonna ride a bike. Where should we go? Hot kettle cafe is what she said. Oh. Wee! <laughs> what is this animation? New Nancy Drew game? Oh, unfortunately, no. This game came out when I was young, so. And I'm old, so it's an older game. Let's see. Danger on Deception Island. Let's see. Let's see when this game came out. 2003 so I was 13 why did all the good games come out when I was 13 wait this game came out in 2003 when did the when did Haunted Mansion come out Oh wait, not Haunted Mansion. Excuse me, Haunted Carousel. Oh my god. 2000. Wow! They released Haunted Carousel in July, and then this game in October. Huh. Interesting. I know, I was just playing around. I don't have the name memorized, and uh, an ad was playing. Oh, it's okay. Hi, Nico! No, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> these are these are my childhood, Nico. You have no idea. They're really fun. And chat chat seems to really like them because they're very there's a reason why we like these games, okay? They're pretty darn good. They need to keep making more of these games. Atlantic Herring. Hey, Jenna, it was good to visit you last month. Boy, do I miss that clam chowder. Uh, oh, and you too. Love, Kim. Can you send me the recipe? Who is this person? Why do they leave their thing here? What is this sound? What is this? Is this the Loch Ness Monster? Chowder. Lemon, when can I visit you so I can hang out with you? <laughs> I think I always ask this every single time. <laughs> A book on sea monsters. Ooh, very cool. Sea monsters, aka whales. Shark. Do I have to read this? Oh my god. Is it called a plesiosaurus? Oh my god, look at this shark. It's a shark whale. Those are a real. Do I, ha I don't have to read that right now, do I? <laughs> oh, and is that why y'all are doing the flute? <laughs> Hi, Loki. <laughs> I didn't even hear it. Subnautica stream win. Ugh. There's nobody here. Why is it so noisy? What is this? What is this? Anytime. 
There's nobody here. Why are they acting like it's so busy? Oh! oh it's like I can't go in there. Okay, <laughs> just kidding. They are busy. What is this? Postcard? A crab! Female and male. I can't tell the difference. Maritime signal flag. What does this mean? Okay. Probably gonna need that later. Oh, there's two people here. Who should I talk to first? Party to see Charlie! <laughs> <laughs> Who do I talk to first? Ugly pants guy? He's wearing jeans. <laughs> well, well, looks like Snake Horse Harbor's got itself a newcomer. I'm visiting Katie Firestone. My name's Nancy Drew. He looks like a writer. Well, why would you want to do a thing like that? Call myself Nancy Drew? Or visit Katie Firestone. Well, you're not one of them save the whale and uh, heck with everybody else crusader types. Oh, like he's she, a fisher. Buddy. I'm wrong. I, I'm just he looks like a fisher. Her true colors came out real clear last night. Us fishermen don't count. All that matters is rescuing that poor precious orca out there. To heck with people trying to make a living. Of course, is the way she makes her living being hurt by that whale? Why, no. Her business is booming. Now, ain't that the oddest thing? Her boat was ransacked this morning. She ticked off a lot of people last night. So she That's deserves she it? Being so meddlesome. Anyway, welcome to Snake Horse Harbor, home of Cadborosaurus. That's how this place got its name, you know. Cadborosaurus? Cadborosaurus? Who's Cadborosaurus? Borosaurus. Well, that's the sea monster Native Americans used to see out in the channel ever so often. Called it the snake horse. Had the head of a horse and the body of a giant snake. People on Vancouver Island started calling it Cadborosaurus after it or one of its relatives was seen a couple of times at Cadbora Bay. They call it Caddy for short. Caddy. What? Low res jeans. Is it so. a friendly sea monster? <laughs> Back in the late 1800s, he took the rap for a lot of hoodoo around here. Hoodoo? Fog would roll in at night, and men would just vanish. It was the snake horse, people would say. <laughs> Little did they know. Why do you think they vanished? Well, they'd been they... Shanghai. See, a bunch of establishments in town had secret panels built right into the walls what is guy be having a drink one minute next minute he'd be clobbered over the head whisked into a secret passageway and taken out to a ship waiting in the harbor but he'd wake up on the high seas Human and discover that if he wanted to survive he'd better do what the captain ordered no matter what he was before he was now a sailor it was a cheap way for captains to get crews back then and an easy way for some of the town's citizens to make money Oh. Huh. Okay. Interesting. Whoever trashed Katie's boat also ruined her GPS. This guy's flexing oh, no, on us. That's a what, shame. ambient? <laughs> Are you sure you should have been playing these games as a kid, Kylie? Oh, I mean, like, this would make sense now. As a child, it probably wouldn't make sense. I'd probably been like, oh, kidnapped. Which is even worse, which is worse too, but... <laughs> Being kidnapped for a job on a boat. Whoa. Thing is, I'd like to go kayaking while I'm here. Only I can't without a GPS. I don't oh, want to go no, kayaking. That really is a shame. Tell you what, I got a spare right here in my duffel. You know what else I got in my duffel? I don't want to know. Why am I getting the feeling I'm not going to like this? This is a little seamanship quiz oh. I whipped up. What? Quiz? I'm thinking about making people pass it before they're allowed to rent any kind of watercraft once I become harbor master. Uh, Here. Quiz. Hi. I will always treasure now a Kylie stream with some chill Nancy Drew. When are we getting Kylie a monocle? I'll wear it. <laughs> 
chat. This is y'all special The idea tea. is to cut down on having to rescue people who got no business being thing. out on the water in the first place. Trouble is, nobody's actually taken it yet. I need a guinea pig. And that would be me? If you pass the quiz, the GPS is yours. You'll need that container for the last question. A basket? See you around. Vote for Holt. Spread the word. You again? Did you say you were a fisherman? Fourth generation. I've fished every ocean for just about every fish you can make money fishing for. Lived here for the last 11 years. Are you retired? Fishermen never retire, young lady. After all, what would we do? Go fishing? <laughs> <laughs> the only reason I'm not out there right now is because I've been in and out of campaign meetings since 8 this morning. You're running for office? I think it's high time people around here started doing what makes sense. Instead of doing what's politically correct all the time, Arbor Master we got now bends over backwards so far for the environmentalists, it's a wonder he can still walk upright. That's good though. See you around. Yo ho ho. <laughs> <laughs> Yo ho ho. All right, let's see what this quiz is like. The sun always sets in the. What in the world? <laughs> <laughs> Confound you, Nancy, Nancy Drew! Thanks, CSS. Whale, Whale lover. Yo ho ho! The, uh, what's the Beauty and the Beast song? Tell us all this time. Time here we What is the What is the lyric that tells you? I always use it to tell. Isn't it in the East? What is it? What is the song? The Beauty and the Beast? You know? What? That's in the West. Do you know what I mean? That's how I always know because of that song. They can never remember. Yesterday was your birthday, Locus. Do you have a good birthday? You do anything fun? What is this lyric? What is the lyric, guys? Starting as a sign, rising in the east. That's it. Does it does it also say setting in the wet? No, it doesn't have that in the lyric. Okay. Anyways, that's how I remember. Even though I don't even remember the lyric. Okay. Rising in the east. Me, 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 me. Me, 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 me. Me, 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 I learned that the sun sets in the west from Five Will Goes West. Wait, how? I know that movie. Okay, so west. That looks right. What is the current fine for clamming without a permit? What, $1,000? Huh. The left side of the boat is the... <gasps> nah. Port! Good. Ah! The moon always rises in the... Oh, I don't have a song for this. <laughs> the dog says it. You heard him. I was like, whoa. Uh, the moon always right, right, east? Yes! Okay. Wait, I didn't even actually know that. I just learned something. What does this mean? Morse code. Oh no! The Morse code's back! The North Star is part of what constellation? I don't know. Oh my god, there's more! A schooner is a boat with at least two sails. No. Anchor. No. Window. No. Buoys? No. The Big Dipper? Not. 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 Oh, Mass? Very good. Wrong. I don't know. Oh, what? What kind of knot is it? Nope. A naughty knot. Bring me a male crab? Oh! Oh, wait. What does a male crab look like? It has abs. So he's just less wide in the middle? He's just less wide in the middle. Okay, we have to buy bring a male crab. Ursa Major? 
not oh maybe it's like er not little dipper am i smart or what it's the little dipper oh oops sorry i didn't see it earlier <laughs> At least you noticed. <laughs> I was wondering, I was like, is anybody going to say anything? <laughs> laughing at my jokes ever. I think I'm funny. What can I get for you, Nancy? <sighs> Since we haven't met, there's only one way you could know my name. On the day my Aunt Iris turned this place over to me, she said, Jenna, you're about to become a real good listener. And darn if she wasn't right. How long ago was that? Aunt Iris left like it to me three shirt. years ago. It's been in the Dublin family since the day it was built, which was back in like... 1866 or something. So, you're visiting Katie Firestone. My condolences. Your condolences? Why does everybody you know, hate don't see eye to eye on a couple of things. What kind of things? That orca out there should be rejoined with her pod as soon as possible. Period. End of story. No matter what Miss Fancy Schmancy science degree says, other people may be bamboozled by all her talk of data charts and field tests and monitoring whatnots, but not me. The only thing she wants is to get that whale into an aquarium. It wouldn't surprise me if Katie's been secretly feeding it. Which is against the law, by the way. And you know what else? It wouldn't surprise me if she trashed her own boat because she knew that after that meeting last night, everybody would assume that Holt did it and not want to vote for him. I got an idea. Let's change the subject. Oh. Oh, she's on to something, though. The Morse code is follow Miss Kyla's YouTube so that you can watch the videos after stream. <laughs> Probably because she's a ginger. <laughs> I'm laughing inside. That's not good enough, Jai. I think the knots type is a bend. Okay. We probably have to actually be smarty pants and actually look around. Just... Oh, we'll figure it out. It'll be fine. Does Andy Jason ever come in here? Everybody comes in here. Know how some people can't go a day without coffee? People around here can't go a day without a bowl of my clam chowder. In Ooh, fact, if you ever want a free chowder. sample, just say the word. Okay. So Andy Jason is one of your regulars? Y'all want some clam Actually, chowder? he only comes in once or twice a week. Says he's too busy. Of course, the reason he's so busy is because he's too cheap to hire another person to help him run the place. Kind of surprised me when I heard he was trying to buy Katie Firestone <gasps> out. Must have something up his sleeves, all I can figure. What do you know about the shanghaiing that used to go on around here? It never went on, that's what I know. Shoving grown men into passageways and carting them off to ships never to be seen again? It's just a big colorful tale. I feel like tale. that's not never a nice happened. word to say. Is that, is that not a nice word to say? Shanghai? Sounds not nice. Think I could try a bowl of your clam chowder? Clam Coming chowder! Right up. Next one will be on the house too. Mmm. Mmm. That was delicious. Here, let me get rid of that for you. It's been fun talking to oh you. My god. Gotcha. The food in this game. Only two crackers. I know the audacity. I eat I eat every bite I usually have with soup. I always eat freaking cracker with it. But again. Hi Nancy, how's it going? No, it's been fun give talking me to you. Another Ain't that one. The truth? Oh well. Okay, so we need to find a crab. We need to figure out... Oh, we need to go this guy. I have a feeling this is the guy that did it. This is the guy, chat. This is it. This is the guy who... It, it's her competitor. Or maybe that's too... Is that too obvious? I don't know. It's either she ruined her own boat or this guy did it. But the thing is... His card was under the plumbing. So, clamming permit sold here. Oh, 138.43. Huh. Crap. 
perfect. Ah! Got the question. I got got the got the question. Is this the Miss Kylie? Hi, Hag. Hi there. Welcome. What can I do you for? What can I do you for? Are you Andy Jason? That's His me. Fuzzy How'd hair. You know? He looks like that kid from Boy Meets World. I'm Nancy Drew. I'm a friend of Katie Firestone. He's being framed. I saw Could your business possibly. card on the boat. Nice to meet you, Nancy. Any friend of Katie's is a friend of mine. So you consider yourself to be a friend of Katie's? Corey. I like to think we're friends, or that we could be friends if she'd just be reasonable. You mean if she'd just accept your offer? I'm offering her the deal of a lifetime. She'd make more money, she'd have more free time. I mean, look at this place. I run a first-class operation. It's my mission to see that everyone who comes to Snake Horse Harbor leaves with a greater appreciation for marine mammals. And if I make a buck in the process, that's cool too. Why do you want to buy Katie out? She can't be taking that many customers away from you. I don't like her taking any customers away from me. And frankly, with this whale doing its orphan thing out there, I'm losing a lot of customers to her. Bro, this sounds like 100% he totally destroyed her Isn't the whale just boat. as good for your business as it is for hers? Katie convinced the fishery service that she should be allowed to monitor the orca's condition. Which means she can get right up next to the whale while my boat has to stay away. Oh. Katie takes passengers with her when she checks on the whale? Paying passengers. As many as she can safely fit. Oh. What do you think should be done with the orca out there? Huh. Nothing. I think people should just leave it alone. I mean, why do we humans always think we know best? We can barely deal with ourselves, let alone a whole other species. Amen. <laughs> Someone ransacked Katie's boat while she was in town this morning. Made a real mess. Hmm. Wonder if it's related to those burglaries. What burglaries? A bunch of stuff was stolen from two shops earlier this week. Food, tools, clothing, electronics. There was no sign of forced entry, no trace of who did it. Sheriff's still scratching his head. Whoever ransacked Katie's boat tore a bunch of parts out of her engine. It's like they wanted to make sure she couldn't go anywhere for a while. That's too bad. He doesn't sound that remorseful, though. In a way, it's kind of good. I mean, for you, at least. Very true. As long as her boat's out of commission, I'll get all her customers. Thanks for your time. Whales rule! I don't like this guy. Just for that. I don't like that guy. I don't like that guy. Nancy Drew is a classic. Hi, Worth! It is... Unique, free... The unique keychain free Hi, Nancy. to everyone who takes our well watching Thanks for your tour. time. Drop uh, by again. I will never talk to you ever again for the rest of my life. <gasps> it's a museum. Ew. No. Wonderful. Oh my god, is this the game that made me terrified of whales? <laughs> I think this is the game. <laughs> now I'm just like slowly remembering everything. Whales, dolphins, por porpoises. No, I don't think this was. I honestly cannot remember. Whales, dolphins, porpoises belong to the scientific order Cetacea. They are mammals, that is. They are warm-blooded and nurse their young, and though they spend their entire lives in water, they have lungs, not gills, and are not fish. All cetaceans have streamlined bodies, paddle-shaped front limbs, vestigial hind limbs, which cannot be seen because they are inside the body wall. Oh. A horizontal tail, a single or double blowhole on the top of their head, no sweat glands, and a thick subcutaneous blubber layer for insulation. Among the cetaceans commonly found in the waters of the Pacific Northwest are the Dalles porpoise, the humpback gray mink whales, and the orca whale. Look, it's orca! All orcas look alike. Not. To keep track of an individual orca, scientists record the nicks and scars on their dorsal fins as well as the size and shape of the gray saddle patches just behind them. Also, adult males have tall, up to six feet triangle-shaped fins, while those of females are about three feet tall and curved. Scientists can often quickly tell to which pod an orca belongs, how old it is, and who its mother is just by looking at its dorsal fin. Dang. Childhood trauma revealed. Oh no. 
Orca whale is among the largest predators of mammals in existence. It is actually a type of dolphin, but, do but because of its size, it's referred to as a whale. It got its name from whalers who called it a whale killer after seeing them kill and eat other whales. The two words eventually got switched around to killer whale. Ah. Orcas live in social groups called pods. Pods vary in size from 5 to 30. Females dominate the, po dominate the pod. Heck yeah! Kylie revisiting her childhood traumas. We're getting everything out of the way today. Uh, maternal pods form subpods within the pod. With mothers, daughters, sisters, and cousins traveling together, members of a pod use the same vocalization system or dialect to communicate. These dialects are so distinctive that scientists can often use them to identify the pod to which individual orca belongs. In contrast, baleen whales tend to be found singly, singly or in loosely form. What about the males? No. Hmm. Free Willy was not a fun time. Brain comparison. Notice how wrinkly all the brains are. The more folds and wrinkles, the larger the surface area of the brain, and presumably the greater the capacity for thought. Notice too that an orca's brain is almost four times the size of humans. There's another reason why you should be terrified of these things. <laughs> what is this? Insert Looks like card? I need a key card to play. Oh, what am I playing? From Flipper to Free Willy, the entertainment media are full of examples of how intelligence... Blah, blah, blah. Uh... It got so quiet. How does that not terrify you? How can that not freak somebody out? Like, that sounds so just... There's something wrong. Oh my god. They're 45 feet long. <laughs> These are like the sounds that they make to create scary movies. Ugh, no. That doesn't bother me. These things are small. I'm assuming. How, how small are these? They're probably like a dolphin. Why are they a dolphin? Oh. oh. <laughs> I know, I like the... Spelling out the sound. Sounds like Metroid area. That just sounds... It just sounds so scary. Whale of Fortune? Oh my god, why did I agree to this game? <laughs> um... How do I get a card? I think, I feel like I have to play this. Whoa, what is this? Miss? Please don't touch that. Oh, sorry. Do I talk to him again to get like a card? Hi, or Nancy. I'd like to play the games in your center, but it looks like I need some kind of key card. Here you go. This will activate all the games. It will also keep track of what games you've won, and it'll let you play all the games as many times as you want. Cool. Thanks for your time. My pleasure. It's the reverb that makes it scary. Can we get ocean sound CD to fall asleep to? Like ocean sounds like waves? That's fine. I'm gonna listen to 
Sony whale sounds tonight to help me sleep. Oh, some whale. Eh. Oh no, a pot of whales is trapped in the inlet. Swim to freedom. Use a quiz to help them swim to open water. Get each correct answer moves them closer to freedom. Get two wrong, you have to start over. Oh, great. Oh, crap. Ooh, I got it right. Sea mammals, including dolphins and killer whales, have been trained by the military because they are extremely stupid. That's why. Fond of being bossed around. Yes. Orcas are called killer whales because they are killed by whales. No, they kill and eat other whales. How many blowholes do baleen whales have? Oh, I haven't read any of this. Okay, you know what? Give I'll do better second, next okay? time. They use whales to retrieve objects deep in the water. Really? They communicate with each other and obviously respond to human commands. The frontal lobes of their brains are much larger than that of humans. This suggests some scientists that some assume would be yes. Because a whale is a mammal, it cannot breathe underwater through gills like a fish. Just like you, it must hold its breath. The bigger the whale, the bigger its lungs, and the longer it can stay underwater. Orcas can stay underwater for up to 10 minutes at a time, while humpbacks can stay underwater for 30 minutes. Most, most whales have shorter dives lasting anywhere from 1 to 15 minutes. Because whales usually dive in order to feed, how deep a whale dives depends on where it's hunt what it's hunting. It's whales, it, all whales can dive to a depth of several hundred feet. The deepest recorded dive by an orca was 900 feet. The humpbacks regularly dive to 485 feet, while greys can dive to 390. I'm happy they don't have blue whales here. <laughs> I gotta be honest with you. Um, is there a bomb strapped to that whale? It looks like it. The mink whale is a sleek torpedo-shaped whale capable of swimming at high, at high speeds. The common name mink is referred to a Norwegian whaler who thought the mink whales he saw were actually its much larger cousins, blue whales. He thought they were blue whales? What an idiot. Mink whale is the smallest baleen whale, averaging 25 to 30 feet in length and weighing about 6 to 7.5 tons. Oh my god, it's- wait, what? It has a narrow, shape, sharply pointed snout and a sickle-shaped dorsal fin. Because it starts to exhale, exhale before it reaches the surface, its bow is relatively low, rising Oh my god. No. Here to prefer deep cold waters are found only in the Pacific Ocean and the Northern Hemisphere. They are rarely found in the southern extremes of the range during the summer months. It has a small head and a stocky, muscular body. It is six to eight feet long and weighs up to four. It's the fastest swimmer up to 35 miles per hour. The V shaped forward-facing splash or rooster tail, which it creates when swimming full speed, helps observers identify it. Ugh. Mega Patera Nova Lebelebele. That's the humpback whale, so that's the first question. Hi, Nash! Hello! Whale facts bring out the toxicity. <laughs> Average is about 43 feet. It can weigh 25 to 35 tons. It has very large flippers, small dorsal fin. Like all baling whales, it has two blowholes. When it exhales after a dive, its spray can its its spray can rise 10 to 13 feet. When diving, it humps its back. <sighs> How are you doing, Nash? Thank you for the tier two. I'm being, I'm going through my childhood trauma right now. Forgive me if I'm not like, <laughs> I don't have to do this. What does the common name humpback refer to? The small fatty dorsal fin near the back of the whale gives the appearance of a small hump. This hump is where? 
I don't care. This hump is further exaggerated when the whale dives as its tail bends in a sharp angle. For those reasons, whale is called the humpback. Oh. Okay. Oh my god, I should probably get this one over with. What do whales and bats have in common? Like bats, tooth, whales, toothed? Whales. I able to locate and identify objects by creating and projecting high frequency sound waves and listening to the echoes. You can use echolocation. Baleen whales uh, lack this ability. Whale has a larynx but no vocal cords, yet it can produce a variety of sounds from moans and grunts to chirps and whistles. Scientists aren't sure how whales make sounds, but they believe whales do so in order to communicate with other whales. The humpback whale is famous for its songs or repeating units of sounds, some of which can go on for more than 30 minutes. Whales have an acute sense of hearing, but while baleen whales have tiny external ear openings, tooth whales do not. Scientists believe that tooth whales hear or receive sound waves primarily through their lower jaws. Oh god, here we go. Throughout the center, you've been able to hear the sounds different cetaceans make. To see just how good your memory is, uh, I'm being tortured. press a button, listen to the sound that plays, then press the button of the cetacean that made the sound. If you've made a I correct match, whale the nightmares. button lights will stay on. <laughs> when all the buttons are lit, you've matched them all. Stop playing the whole thing! I know it's a gray whale! Stop it! How do I match them? Stop playing it! I don't like this at all. Wait. Okay. I still don't understand how people find that relaxing. It literally sounds like a ghost. That? Never will do that again for the rest of my life. What's this game? What is this? What whales eat? They belong to the suborder Adomtosita. Have teeth. Among them are dolls. Purposes would feed on squid, crustaceans, and a variety of schooling fish and killer whales, which are at the top of the food chain. They consume fish, squid, other otters, birds, sea turtles, penguins, and other cetaceans. The suborder Mystic. Mystic Seti? Includes the gray meek and humpback whales. These cetaceans have baleen plates instead of teeth. And though they are bigger than Odonsenta they eat is contrastly tiny krill, plankton, small fish, and humans if they get in the way. And anchovies. Neither tooth whales nor baleen whales seem to have a sense of smell. Thankfully, whales don't seem to be the least bit interested in making humans part of their diet. No, but if you're in their way, they'll eat you! Mm -mm. Just out on the ocean at night in your big wood ship, you hear a blue whale crying somewhere in the distance. I thought you can only heal, hear whales underwater. <laughs> Sound was recorded for a different Nancy Drew game with ghosts. They just actually put it in this game. <laughs> I can't understand why they had so many sea monster stories. <laughs> yeah, imagine not knowing what a freaking whale was back in the day. <laughs> and you just see this thing and you're like, what the heck? Mm, rather than using their teeth to chew, they use them to grab and crush their prey before swallowing it. The doll's purpose has sharp spade-shaped teeth while the orca's teeth are conical and pointed. 
Thorgus teeth to bite chunks out of larger prey, but can swallow smaller prey like seals and walruses whole. Uh, they feed by locating large concentrations of krill, plankton, or fish, filling their mouths with huge amounts of water, and then squeezing the water out of their mouths through the bristles of the baling plates. That Oh, that's how they get the water out? It, this filters out the water and leaves their prey, which they then swallow. Oh my god. Most mis oh my god, can you imagine being stuck in a humpback's mouth? Ugh. This filters uh this filters of the water and leaves their prey which they swallow. Most have grooves under their chins which allow their throats to greatly exp oh my god. This is but that but what happens to the kayak? How do they do they spit it out? Like what did it no, DSS. Where is Dory? I heard she's good at <laughs> talking to whales. Uh, what do we do here? Whales are hungry. When they surface, give them a fish. Yum! Yeah! Yum! 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 Yeah, I clicked on that Yum! One. Yum! 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 I did it! Yeah, I did it! <laughs> yum! 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 <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> yum! <laughs> Start. Mm, mink whales have dorsal fin shaped like a... Sickle? Ah. The diet of baling whales consists mostly of... Small fish and plankton. The diet of toothed whales consists mostly of humans! Um, fish and other sea am mammals. Throats of the bailing whales commonly seen through Deception Island are always... Uh... Flabby. Uh... I don't know... Grooved? Oh, grooved! An example of a bailing whale is... Was it all of the above? Tooth whales do not possess. All of the above? I did it! Dolly the Dow's pur porpoise must do certain things to survive, like eat. Breathe and avoid her enemies. Use your keyboard arrows to make sure she eats. Doesn't run out of air and avoids the dangers from her lurking in the ocean. Um, Nancy Drew aim trailer trainer. Whales kill over a thousand humans per year. What? Oh. <laughs> I'm like, what, Adam? I was like, no, what? <laughs> like, I know it's not that high. <laughs> oh, just because I don't like whales doesn't mean I don't want anybody to hurt them. Don't hurt anything. Just, just leave it alone. I can eat you. Hard. Uh oh. Oh. Yum, yum. Oh my god, is that a missile? Uh -oh. oh my god! Can it eat a squid? Is that a freaking missile? Freaking torpedo? This is fun. I like this. 
Uh, oh. Oh, I died. Oh, I'll try it again. Am I still on hard? Going up. Nuclear waste. <laughs> Can I eat that squid? I don't think so. It's bigger than me, so I'm gonna say no. There's a shark. I did it! Oh yeah, your prize. T-shirt, toy, shark, $5 gift coupon, caddy cap, whale tour. What do I do now? Do I go to the wheel? Belly up? <laughs> Once you've won all the activities in the center, insert your card. Okay. Tour. All right. Heck yeah, bro. Give me that sick prize. Look at that. Hi, Nancy. I won a free whale watching tour. Well, congratulations. I'll give you an exclusive tour. Just be you and me. I'm good. I'm good. I don't want it. I'm ready when you are. Hey, we're going now. <coughs> That's some deer, sir. That's not a whale. Oh, it's a bird. Oh. I would. Thank you for the great tour I am and for letting me use your camera. My pleasure. <laughs> I'm gonna get so many nightmares. <laughs> I thought I was actually enjoying it. I was like, look at the otter. Uh... I was sitting here falling asleep. <laughs> and that. <laughs> Thanks for your time. Have a good one. Okay, we're done here. Mm. Lighthouse, maybe? I should save. I haven't saved in a while. She's gonna delay stream tomorrow. I saw whales yesterday. To be fair though, those noises are scary. It's crazy that people think that they're not. That's terrifying. And... Yeah. And yeah. Yuck! I'm not picking them up. Peach. Peach. These would be great for rock skipping. Ah. I'm gonna I already them. have some rocks. I got some rocks, chat. Which these? Ah! Uh Is this a male? Female? Okay. Oh, wait. Wait, oops. Remember. Eyes open, mouth shut. Okay, good. I got rid of it. I actually picked it up. I already have some rocks. I already have some rocks. I already have some rocks. I already got some rocks. I already got some rats. Oh my god. Crab! Oh, what's this? Hmm. A sandwich. <laughs> There's 
something in that bottle. Hmm. Hmm. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Time to waste here, chat. This is how I. Where am I? I'm at the lighthouse. No trespassing. Keep out. Oh. What do you think you're doing? Those signs over there say no trespassing, which means keep out. Which means you, girly. Girly? Leave. But I just. Now. Why is he all of a sudden so loud? Go! I got your crab. <laughs> Girly. <laughs> Why did he get so loud all of a sudden? Got us the rock the right way. <laughs> I've been racing in with. <sighs> okay. Uh, what else do we need to know in the quiz? Is he gonna still let me get the GPS even though he's mad at me? Morse code. Slipknot? Nope. <laughs> uh, what did we say the name? Wait, wait, how do I find it? <laughs> Portal? Search. Oh, Morse code. Okay. Dot, 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 dash. Dot, 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 dash. V. V. Dash, dash, dash. O, V, O, V, O. Is it just a dash? Dot? There's one. I think there's just, just one dash. So E. T, O, oh, vote. Oh, vote. Vote for... What was his name? Hort? Wrong. Vote for... What was his name? Holt! Wrong. Oh. B-O-T-E. Four dashes. Or four dots, one dash. Oh, vote for Holt. Correct. Wow. Subliminal messaging. Um, not, what is this? 
No, I don't want this. Hold on. Ah! What is this one? Crab. Crab. Ah, it's so shiny. Click the flip. Ah. Ah. Boil it 20 minutes. Yum. I love crab. Not samples. This one. This one. Fisherman's knot. Perfect. Kind of knot, it's a bend. Oh yeah, you were right, Ninja. That should do it. I have to bring him a male Dungeness crab? Bro, I already got it. Don't worry about it. Nautical terms, sun, moon, north star, and sea, sailboat types, a map of deception, and just store. Cool! Yeah! I think the music gets happier when we, like, eat it. What's up? Sounds like Holt Scotto was one of the people who didn't care for what you had to say last night. He and I never see eye to eye. Now, if I were a fisherman, I'd be right as rain no matter what nonsense came out of my mouth. Fine harbor master he'd make. I talked to Jenna Deblin when I was at the hot kettle. What nasty rumor is she spreading about me today? Why would she spread rumors about you? She thinks I'm a know-it-all from the big city. I found this piece of wood on the beach. There's something strange about it. What do you mean? Let's see it. Ouch, those splinters are sharp. That is odd. It looks like it's been in the water a long time, but if that were the case, those edges would be dull. That looks like it broke off of something just recently. That's exactly what I was thinking. Any idea where it came from? Could be off a cargo ship, I guess. But you know who you should ask? Casey Porterfield. He works at the Maritime Library in Port Townsend. You should give him a call. His number is 360-555-3095. He loves checking out stuff like this. See you in a bit. Be careful out there. All right, let's go to the mean guy. Let's go to the mean guy and give him his stupid quiz back. Is this game about solving mysteries? Mm -hmm. Yep, pretty much. Puzzles. Talking to people, uncovering their you again secrets, you know. I'm sorry for trespassing like that. So what do you want? I finished that seamanship quiz. Let's have a look. Right as rain. Just bring me that male crab and you'll be home free. I've got a male crab, I think. Let's have a look. Right as rain. Woo! Congratulations. Here's your GPS. Just turn around and follow the instructions. I'll take care of the crab for you. Great, thank you. He took my crab, he's gonna eat it. Martin, no! See you around. Yo ho ho. <laughs> Yo ho ho. Hi Nancy, how's it going? I found a bottle floating in the water with a strange message inside. Most if not all the notes you find in bottles around here were put there by Hilda Swenson. She was this lady who retired here with her husband about 20 years ago. They made a ton of money in Hollywood as writer-producers and just wanted to enjoy life. Wonderful people. Very active. In fact, Hilda was mayor for eight years. But then, out of the blue, her husband died. They'd been a team for so long that, well, she pretty much died then too. Aww. Did she move away? She just kind of lost it. Started Aww. talking to walls and doing bizarre things until one day she rode to the island across the channel that she and her husband owned and never came back. Oh. And now she uses notes and bottles to communicate with people? Trouble is, nobody can understand what she's trying to say. All she ever writes is letters and numbers and that one word. Rosebud. I leave a couple of bags of groceries outside her cabin every week, and sometimes I can see her inside. But whenever I try to talk to her, she won't answer. I thought she said she was on an island. I wonder what she's trying to tell us. We'll never know what's going on in that mind of hers. Rosebud. <laughs> if the detective became a good artist, would she be called Fancy Drew? You know, your clam chowder <gasps> really clam is chowder. awesome. Say no more. Next one will be on the house, too. Hmm. Mmm, that was delicious. Here, let me get rid of it's that for me you. Hungry. It's been fun talking to you. Yeah, hasn't it though? I like my sandwich more. Alright, should we go kayaking? 
I want clam chowder now, chat. It's late, what are y'all doing? We're eating clam chowder. I'd rather have the fun day. Yeah, that's fair. What do I, oh, another message. Another message. Hmm. Rose, what? Wait, what? Oh. Oh, I died. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Wait, did I forget? Oh, I forgot to hit on the live jacket! Okay. Hold on, let me save. Um... Kayak? I guess. Kayaking... Better not see a freaking whale out here. What is going on? I died. I died. There's One click. A channel marker. Katie said not to go past them. Oh darn it! Disappears. Okay. Well, that was just. I did that one on purpose. <laughs> The only thing- you can just do second chance and it'll always take you back. What was that sound? Better than a whale eating you. That is true. Where do I go? Ew, jellyfish? Jellyfish! Jellyfish! Danger beyond this point. I don't know where I'm swimming. I like the noises though. The swimming noises. Was that a cave? <gasps> Guess we're on a, a hunt for bottles. Oh. to the point. <laughs> it is. Wait, I don't want to go this way. A Citizen Kane reference? What does that mean? You got killed by rats? Wait, what? <laughs> I could go. Okay, well, I got all of these. I have four of them now. Maybe I can talk to her. What's up? Oh. See you in a bit. Have fun. Oh, wait, was I supposed to use the GPS? Uh, oh. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, what's up here? Oh, I, I should even... finish this before I go looking at the slides in there. Wait, what's what am I doing? One slice of wood. One glass slide. There. 
This is gonna look so cool under the microscope. So cool! Let's look at what wood looks like under the microphone, microglade, mic whatever. Let's have a look. <laughs> Too cool. Ew. What do I do? Hard ball. Waterproof. Butterfly wing. Ugh. Raw meat. Awesome. A flea. Ew. Wow. Onion. Wow. Air. Ugh. Feather. <laughs> Identify the crab in the Discord. Which channel? Which channel? Tag or? Female? Wait! Food? Wait, where'd y'all go? Tubbro left out the heart hands. Wow, Tubbro. Wait, where'd y'all go? That looks fun. Wait, when did you post this? What'd y'all do yesterday? Where the... That's cool. No, that's what the botanical garden is. Oh! Neither? What the heck is the thing in the center? Also, what? Freaking of eating crab while watching this? Y'all are another level of immersion. I want to eat crab right now. Where did y'all get these? What the heck? Did you cook them? It's male. Yeah, I'm thinking male too. I don't know if it's your hands, but this one looks smaller and aren't the female ones bigger? Or something? True fans! Wait, Kat's dad brought us some crabs. My dad brought us some crabs and caught us weekend. What? That's so cool! He caught them? Wait, how did he catch them? Is he a fisherman? Kylie, check your own. Not checking your own. Well, I haven't. I've been streaming. And yesterday I was busy. This bottle, of course. <laughs> I want to try crab with clarified. What's clarified butter? Y'all, open invitation for literally anyone. Come crabbing with. Can I? I'm down. Sold. Oh my god. I've actually always wanted to do that. As long as I don't have to, like, catch it by my hand. With my hand, I'm good. There's some people that catch the crabs underneath the rocks with their bare hands. I could never. <laughs> no. It's a tradition! We go out on a boat with turkey neck turkey necks and catch them. Wait, what? When? Any time? Can I come? Only in the summer? Wait, when? Can I come? You catch them on a string? I'm crabbing every day. I don't get enough sleep. <laughs> when you go crabbing, watch out for a whip. Fishing is gross and boring. Aw. I think you just need to go fishing with me, Fluffy. I make fishing exciting. That sounds so fun! Oh, can I come? Next weekend? No, I'm just kidding. I don't know when, but... Oh my god, I would actually just love to do that. I bet Todd would drive me. And he'd probably want to do it too. Todd! Is he here? Todd! 
Welcome to Maryland, we have crabs. That sounds funny. Um, cool. Wait, where? Is it like a lake nearby? That has crabs? She's really trying to sell us on the deep sea fishing. I, if y'all aren't going, I'm gonna go. Like, that's all I'm saying. Kylie, is it exciting because you we have to chase the fish as it drags you away? No. I want to go deep sea fishing. I've never gone, and I really, really want to go. And I have a vacation coming up in July where I have an opportunity to go. It's a little pricey, um, and I'm not sure how it works if only I want to go, but yeah. <laughs> Probably a lot. Um, uh, well, we'd wait, obviously, for Todd to be, but... We go to a salt... There's a saltwater lake nearby? Cool. If you want to pay the $600 for a fishing tip, I know, it's pretty pricey. I need to keep looking, I think. Are they always that expensive? Does anybody have a friend that does deep sea fishing in Florida? <laughs> does anybody have the hookup? <laughs> My lives on that beach. She is really cool. You can, can she go crabbing with us, Tubbro? <laughs> you can go with the group. That's what I did in Miami. I remember fishing as like six to seven year olds, and then we ate them. <laughs> My dad, my dad used to do that. We used to go, we used to catch, um, mud puppies, or catfish. Uh, and we would eat them. He would fry them. He would skin them and, and we would eat them. Or, you know, clean them and, and then we'd eat them. Fry them and then we'd eat them. It's really good. I remember that as a child. Uh, but yeah. Should it be clear within 10 days? So probably not this week, but next weekend after that. Um, it's funny because JRPGs and Zelda games have always... They always have fishing minigame. I think they love fishing in Japan. Because fishing is amazing! Sushi! Hi, Dragon! My mom has a boat on the water at her house. What? Can we do... No, Evan! <laughs> Ew, I've seen videos of those. Ew, no. Fishes all the time. I've, I've been wanting to go... I don't care what we're fishing. I've been wanting to go fishing for so long. And I don't know anybody here that can take me fishing. It has to take me because I'm not taking it off the hook. But crabs. My dad loves fishing, so we ate a lot of fish too. The nation of fishing is ten. Oh, it's already ten o'clock. Okay. Uh, what should I remind future Kylie? What do we have to do? What do we have to do? Oh, we have to call for the wood thing. Figure out notes. That's all I can think of. Um. Okay, so call dude about uh wood, I guess, and notes in bottle notes, I guess. I'll just save it like that. <laughs> so you all understand. Zang wants you to go have nightmares. Yeah, he does. Okay. We did good, though. We beat Haunted Carousel, and we started the whale game. Yay. Um. <laughs> e. Um. Have someone take you fishing. Finishing? Oh, fishing? That's what future Kylie needs to do. Um. What? Future Kylie don't know how to take fish off the hook. Trust me. Uh, <laughs> current Kylie can't even think of what to remind future Kylie. 
<laughs> yes. Um, thanks for saying Thanks for hanging out! Cat, I'm definitely gonna take you guys up on the offer. Y'all probably already ate all of the crab in the lake, though. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, but yeah, I'll go... I'll go to bed now! And I'll see you guys tomorrow! And guess what tomorrow is? We're gonna start... Now, normally I don't like starting games on mondays but in this rare case that we are going to we're gonna start fire emblem my first fire emblem game ever we're gonna start fire emblem three houses tomorrow oh you know i totally forgot we needed to have the event in my discord could you create it Zang? it's a little late but if you can create it now <laughs> actually nah don't worry about it yeah don't worry about it yeah, I know. I totally forgot about it. My bad. Um, you can add Tales of Arise on Sunday, though. Um, but yeah, Tales of Arise is going to be the second game. But we're not going to start that until Sunday. So we'll play Fire Emblem all this week. Just Fire Emblem. Unless there's, like, another game I want to try out or something. Um, but we'll pretty much Fire Emblem all this week. So I'm excited. I've never played these games before. I will be playing on easy. Just FYI, don't hate me. Um, but yeah, have a wonderful night. Today was very interesting. We saw a lot of good game announcements and trailers. That was fun. We still need to watch um, Wholesome uh, Direct, the Wholesome Direct that was on Saturday. We will watch that tomorrow morning. So if you're not doing anything and you want to wake up to cute games then like we're just gonna watch the trailers we're just i'm just gonna watch the show pretty much um and i don't what how long is it 30 minutes to an hour or something so we'll watch that in the morning and then talk about other stuff and then we'll play fire emblems all right fire emblem three houses so yeah anyways hope you have a wonderful night sleep well see you tomorrow it is one hour okay sleep well don't let the whales bite you um, uh, yeah. Anyways, good night. Bye. <laughs>